Yeah. All right, everyone, please welcome Miss Park Min Young. Uh, Min Young will be appearing at tonight's M Countdown to deliver a brief message, so everyone can look forward to that. I'm so excited to be here in LA, and let's have a great time with you guys. <laughs> okay. So maybe we should move the chair. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you guys, thank you. Wow, so now that you're here, I feel like the mood has gotten so much livelier. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the talk show zone. Um, this is where KCONers will have the chance to get to know you better. Mm -hmm. um, how does it feel to be here at KCON? Um, it's surprising how many people in LA love K content and are so, so supportive. Yeah. <laughs> So how long has it been since you last uh, visited LA and what does it feel to, or how does it feel to be here in LA and is there anything that you really want to do while you're here? Um, last year, last time I was here was before pandemic was, it was like a year 2019 and actually LA is one of my favorite cities so uh, I'm so pumped to be here, and I <laughs> love the California vibe, such a, like, a, a lot of sunshine, palm trees, beautiful sunsets, beautiful restaurants, and, you know, good museums, and I want to enjoy it at all. Yeah, awesome. Yeah, everyone loves LA, I feel like. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> so, Marry My Husband was a huge success, so I'm curious to know, what have you been up to since the series finished airing? Uh, I've been busy. Um, having a fan meeting around the Asia, and I am working on a new project now. Wow, that's awesome. <laughs> I'm so curious to know what kind of project it is. <laughs> <laughs> so um, you've obviously uh, recently wrapped up your fan meetings overseas. Mm -hmm. uh, what was it like getting to meet some of your international fans in person? And were there like any uh, particularly memorable moments? Um, it's always nice to meet my fans in person and this time was is extra special because I haven't you know able to see them for a long time because of the pandemic right. so yeah. it was um, emotional moment because many of them cried and it Aww. made me cry too so it was an emotional experience oh yeah I'm sure um, well, with your show being such a huge global hit, um, I really want to know what went on behind the scenes during mm -hmm. filming. Um, so with that in mind, we prepared our next exhibit that will take us behind the scenes. So um, there are going to be some uh, select scenes from the series that will be shown on the screen. Um, and then we're going to talk about what happened behind the scenes. So you've obviously starred in a lot of uh, hit K-dramas, um, but we prepared, uh, like, uh, we prepared scenes from your uh, most recent K-drama, Marry My Husband. So I can't wait to see what scene will be uh, shown on the screen. So shall we uh, start with the first selected scene? Yeah? Play the video, oh. please. <laughs>
yeah. 근데 지금 조금 방심했다, 그쵸? Girl power. Uh, uh. <laughs> so yeah, there were a lot power. of viewers who were like, I didn't know judo lessons could be so exciting. And mm -hmm. I'm getting butterflies just from watching that scene. So what was it like on set? Um, as you know, Naino is very tall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, super tall. So it was challenging us to, you know, perform the martial arts scenes together. Mm. And as a judo shin, um, he constantly jumped over me over and over. So oh my it God. was fun. <laughs> it was probably easy yeah. for him, right? <laughs> yeah, it's for, yeah, it's like he. How tall is he? I don't know, he's just baby giant. So. <laughs> so I heard that you've been uh, learning judo for a while now. So how, um, I mean, how good would you say that you're at judo? Um, I can say I'm good at it because I learned judo before like 10 years ago for Drama City Hunter. Mm. So uh, it was just I learned the basics, so oh, okay. I, I almost forget it. Oh, okay, I see. <laughs> um, well, would you say that you're good at sports? And if so, like, what kind of sports do you like to uh, do? You like to do? Um, I'm quite like, athletic, so I love many types of sport. It's a, especially golfing. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, yeah. yeah, so to be honest, I once adapted to golf, but these days I'm too busy to go out and play, so mm. all I can do is just watch it on the TV. Yeah, I mean, that's good enough. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> enough. Golf, right? Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, so shall we move on to the next scene? BTS is what I like. 사실 지금 기분은 다이너마이트를 듣고 싶은데 아무리 찾아봐도 없더라고요. 다이너마이트 최고죠. 제 취향은 봄날 쪽이지만. 어, 저도 봄날 좋아하는데. 봄날이요? 다이너마이트 라고요? So this scene received a lot of attention because your character yeah, and Nainu's so. character um, this was like when you guys found out each other's secret which is yeah, that you right. both traveled back in You're time. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, I mean like this became a like people were saying that this is a very uh, unique and clever plot element. Uh -huh. So what were your thoughts when you first read uh, this scene in the script? Um, at first I thought that Bit, uh, using BTS music is very unique and clever idea, as you said. Mm -hmm. But um, I was concerned immediately. I, I was concerned about you know that viewers might not understand the timeline. Mm -hmm. um, soon I realized that viewers are familiar with um, BTS chronological history and release date of their albums. So they know better than me, so. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I knew that it's going to be work at, um, at the last. Yeah, uh, yeah. Time, I mean, there right. are a lot of like BTS armies out there. And, like, yeah, I mean, right. They know. Yeah, whole, right. yeah, 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 there's a lot of army. armies here, yeah. I'm sure. Yeah. They know better than me. Actually. Oh, yeah, they know better than like yes, I think a lot right. of Koreans. <laughs> 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 All right, so, um, oh, well, what is your favorite BTS song? Um, if you have I, one. I like Bomna. It's spring oh, day, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Can you sing us just one line from that song? What about we sing together? Sing a song uh, to like, okay, so which, oh, so, so, yeah, sure. I mean, like, you can pick the verse. I only know, like, one small part of the song. Oh, oh, oh what do you mean? Which, which part which do you know? Is, <laughs> <laughs> is it like, <laughs> uh, Yeah, that's my favorite part. <laughs> that's the only part yeah. I know. Sorry. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> the most, you know, spring yeah. mood. Yeah. All right, so we're going to watch the third and final highlight scene. Mm -hmm. So uh, roll the tape, please. Son. <laughs> so
so there are reviews saying that the look that you um, had in your eyes in this scene left such a lasting impression. <laughs> so, um, you know, like, I just want to know, like, you know, how do you, I mean, you know, people have been saying that, like, you know, as the uh, queen of Korean rom-coms, right, mm -hmm. like, you're really good at gazing uh, romantically at someone. So how do you, can you show us what that romantic gaze is? No. <laughs> Melo, <yeah. laughs> um... Really? <laughs> Without a script <laughs> or anything <laughs> in this situation? <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. No <laughs> one <laughs> Okay. Um, you know, in drama, it's really. Um, so I just try to be the character and feel her emotion, and you really have to immerse yourself in it and forget the people in front of the camera and, and everyone. Mm -hmm. And just imagine it's just him and me in the world. Mm -hmm. And yeah. I really love him at that moment. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. that must be really hard to do. <laughs> <laughs> so we've taken a look at some memorable scenes from the show. Um, since the show was so popular, um, mm -hmm. let's talk a bit more about what uh, went on behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. um, so I heard that Marry My Husband uh, was so popular around the world that it stayed in Amazon Prime Video's global top 10 for 27 weeks, which is over six months. And uh, Marry My Husband received a lot of love from viewers worldwide. Uh, it ranked in the top 10 in many countries, including the US, Canada, Mexico, Brazil, the UK, France, Australia, India, Thailand, and Japan. Um, so how does it feel to see your show become such a huge hit, not only in Korea, but all around the world? Um, seeing our show become a global hit is um, incredibly, and humble experience, humbling experience. And I'm deeply grateful for the fans for you know their support and this success inspires keep telling stories that connect people across culture. Mm -hmm. And thank you everyone who made this journey together. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks to everyone who's seen or her amazing drama, Marry My Husband. Um, so I'm also curious about the casting process. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, how were you first offered this role, and you know, what about the role made you um, decide to accept it? Um, this is funny. And I first received the casting offer from my manager. To be honest, I thought that the title was crazy. You know, at first, <laughs> I mean, were they serious? Because it's my husband. Mm, mm -hmm, it's, mm -hmm. Right, yeah, right. It's, it's, like kind a, of it's a very strange awkward. title. Yeah, strange, yeah. 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 So, but at the same time, I'm curious about it. So once I started reading it, I couldn't stop it. It was mm. just, um, you know, uh, I couldn't put it down. It was a real page turner. Mm -hmm. So I read the entire script in uh, one sitting and then told my manager, this is it. I see, yeah. Um, so it feels like, you know, Mary, my husband, demanded a lot of emotional acting from you. Mm -hmm. So, you know, just, I'm just curious to know, like, was it really hard, uh, like, was there anything difficult about uh, doing all this emotional acting in these, uh, in these scenes? Yes. I had, a, I had to cry so many times in drama because Jiwon is betrayed by only one friend and, you know, yeah. murdered by her husband. I know, that's uh, intense. <laughs> yeah, I felt like the um, whole world fell down. And mm. for instance, when I was crying on the floor at the murder scene, mm. murder scene yeah. I couldn't stop crying because I was incredibly painful and felt, you know, deep, deep sympathy and sorrow for Ji Won. Um, separating my own emotion from Jiwon's, Jiwon's, you know, was tough right after yeah. those heartbreaking scenes. Yeah. And I couldn't stop crying even after the director said cut. 
Oh, so, wow. Yeah. Yeah, my so it must eyes have kind of were, <laughs> you know. <laughs> swollen. <laughs> yeah, so poppy. Yeah, wow. That must have been really hard. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so I'm sure there are also a lot of, you know, fun and memorable, like fun and happy moments on set too, right? Not just like ones where you had to cry a lot. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah so like, do you have any um, particularly like memorable, um, you know, moments uh, from that series? Um, ever since with um, Yi Kyung was always fun <laughs> to, mm -hmm. to play with. And um, the final scene was the most memorable for me the la my last line was now i happy mm -hmm. and that moment i wasn't just playing g1 i was g1 mm -hmm. so and it was so joyful oh wow so it's like you became her yeah right moment. yeah yeah, wow. yeah right, right. um so you know uh, in your opinion like what do you think was the reason for this show's popularity um as an actor, mm -hmm. <laughs> I felt that every single person working on the drama from the main character for, um, to those who smaller roles mm -hmm. was incredibly professional and passionate. We bonded went well together mm -hmm. and creating a magical atmosphere. And so I was, it was only natural for work to be loved by many yeah, yeah as an actor <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah i'm sure yeah yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah i mean like i you know I, like i would um I, i'd like to hear your opinion too as a oh, k journalist and korean american what <laughs> oh, about wow, the okay. aspect <laughs> you found it you know oh, okay you're like putting okay. me on the spot <laughs> Um, well, I feel like there are just so many, uh, you know, aspects about that drama that were just like so uh, appealing. Like uh -huh. I can definitely see why um, it did so well all over the world. Mm -hmm. um, but I would say, you know, if I had to pick like w like one thing, uh -huh. I would say was the acting. Like acting. I felt like the acting was amazing all around. Like all the people in the show, right? Like I thought they were, yeah, like I thought they were all like oh, really good you. actors. And I mean, like, I have to say, especially you, you know, I'm not just saying this because, like, you know, I happen to be talking to you right now. But, um, but no, seriously, like, I feel like you did such an amazing job in that show. Oh, thank you. Yeah. And, like, I felt like you were able to somehow convey, like, so many different emotions just by using your facial expressions. Mm -hmm. And I felt like, you know, just, just by, like, looking at you, like, on the screen, I could tell, you know, what your character felt in that moment. Oh. So there's just, like, a lot of, you know, subtlety, I think, in your facial expressions. Oh I don't gosh. know how you do it. Yeah, I'm like, I thought it was amazing. Oh, I'm so touched. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'm such a huge uh -huh. fan. <laughs> I'm, like, secretly, like, fangirl fangirling right now. I'm, like, trying not to scream. <laughs> um. That's good. That's good. <laughs> yeah. So I also heard some great news. Uh -huh. um, I heard that uh, they're planning a Japanese version of this drama of Marry My Husband. Mm -hmm. um, have you heard of, yeah, like have you heard about this news? And if so, like, I mean, what, do you, like, what are your thoughts? How do you feel about it? Um, yes, I heard about it and I'm looking forward to it. And I'm curious about, you know, Marry My, as you know, Marry My Husband has a distinct Korean feel to it. Mm -hmm. So I'm curious how to, you know, they, they uh, adapted to reflect Japanese culture and, you know, their unique sensibilities. Yeah, 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 that would be, um, yeah, that would be interesting to yeah, see. Yeah, that would be interesting because, yeah, yeah. you I'm know, really curious I, too. I think the kyor, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Korean word kyor, uh -huh. I don't know how to say it in English, but like the, do you have the it? quality? Like, or uh, no, it's kyor. <laughs> it's kind of like a... Between Korean uh, Korean drama and Japanese drama, there ah. you know, there are a whole difference between you know, there's care. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, you like, know, there are many Korean words can translate yeah, it to yeah. English. Like, yeah, so, def yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, kind of like, yeah. Like, so I'm kind curious of like about it. I don't know, like the sensibility, maybe. Is yeah, like kind of maybe. Like the kind style. of. Yeah. Kind of. Yeah. <laughs> so you okay. debuted in. Vibes, vibes, oh. uh, vibes, oh. vibes, <laughs> similar. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank you for that. Thank you. <laughs> so you debuted in 2006. Uh, so it's now been 18 years since your debut. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
So how do you think you've grown and evolved as an actor over those years? Well, it's a serious question. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I've grown and evolved as an actor over these 18 years. Initially, I faced challenges due to limited experience. Mm. But over time, I, um, through diverse roles, I deepened my understanding of acting and learned to express, express emotion more effectively. Mm. Um, my passion for acting remains strong. so. Um, I'm looking forward to advancing further through diverse and meaningful roles after. <laughs> yes. Woo. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that too. I have to say though, like I've actually seen you in like some of your earlier mm -hmm. works. Like I loved you in High Kick and like, oh. I thought, yeah, yeah. So I feel like, you know, you were like, you were always great at acting um, ever since you debuted. You. Um, but, uh, but now like, I think, yeah, like you're like this, like very um, like, you know, well-rounded, like just this incredible actress. Thank so, you. Yeah, yeah. I am very <laughs> So I'm sure that you have uh, a ton of love for every uh -huh. single one of your projects that you've done in the past. Mm -hmm. um, but if you had to pick your uh, top favorite TV show <laughs> or film that you've done, which one would it be and why? It's always like a hardest question. <laughs> you know, it's always changing. <laughs> but <laughs> this, okay, this time, I'll say that um, um, Secretary Kim. What's wrong yeah. with Secretary is my favorite because it, it is a rom com based on the webtoon, as you know. Mm -hmm. So, for more freedom and exaggerated uh, expression in acting, we had a lot on set, a lot. So, we had a pretty you know, fun time. Yeah, shooting, I'm sure. Like, yeah, shooting time. So yeah, that's a classic yeah. K drama. How yeah. many people here love that K drama? Yeah. yeah see. <laughs> oh. Oh wow. Okay. Laya, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> so, what kind of TV or film project would you like to work on next? And um, if you were given a potential offer to appear in a Hollywood. Uh, TV show or film, would you be interested? And if so, like what kind of role might, might you want to take on? Wow, well, so many questions. <laughs> <laughs> um, actually, I am actually working on m my new project, and mm. it's the character I play is completely different from my previous characters. Mm. Um, this character is a bit crazy and <laughs> rough and wild. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> So, I'm already um, really curious. <laughs> yes. And um, uh, so working in Hollywood, um, yes, it would be an honor to be work with them. And it's a global platform um, that offers incredible in opportunities to collaborate with talented filmmakers and actors around the world. So I'm eager to change, uh, challenge myself to diverse roles and allow to me to explore different genres and characters as well. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, like, I mean, I really hope that, you know, Hollywood uh, will come calling soon. And I'm pretty sure we'd all love to see her in a Hollywood show, right? Yeah. <laughs> or film. That'd be great. Yeah. So, wow. <laughs> Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> it's cute. Okay. Okay. I'll close the time. Ah, yeah, I'll get some either. Okay. All right. So, um, so n now we're at, uh, well, it's supposed to be the photo zone. <laughs> <laughs> the photo zone is where we're going to capture the final moments of our special fan meeting with Park Min Young. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, there it is. And so as you can see, the frame is empty right now. Uh, we're all going to create a beautiful work of art that's going to go inside this frame. Um, so we're going to take a group photo so that we can remember today. So are we all ready? Are we all ready to take a group photo with Park Min Young? Yes, yeah. we are ready. Awesome, yeah. Okay. Let's do it. So like. 
So um, I think, yeah, you'll probably like stand I'm like right. standing here. Yeah. Or maybe. Oh, there you go. All right, so why don't we, um, on the count of three, let's everyone say, uh, let's KCON. One, two, three, let's KCON. <laughs> Yay, awesome. Well, thank you all so much for showing up today. <laughs> thank you so much for America. Yeah. Everyone, please give another round of applause for Ms. Pat Min Young, the one and only. All right. Thank you, everyone, for coming Thank today. Thank you, everyone. I love LA. Thank you. <laughs>